morning everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. Today I've got my big December shopping haul for you guys. There's a lot of Christmas bits in here. I've not got everything that I want for Christmas but I will get there eventually. Today I went to Sainsbury's and I also popped into Tesco's because there's a few bits that I needed to get for there. But I went to Sainsbury's because a lot of the stuff that I was wanting was actually cheaper there. The dog food and the cat food was cheaper in Sainsbury's. Cheaper than Tesco and Asda. Sainsbury's was the cheapest for that. And also I uh, was able to get a 15% discount off on my shopping so I saved £37 on my shopping today which I was more than happy with. Anyway, let me stop blathering and I'll get on with my haul. And just a little disclaimer before I start this, the cats are at their most mischievous time of the day and they're running about mad and they love empty shopping bags so you might hear a lot of noise in the background. Anyway, so chilled stuff. I got two packets of the chicken curry pies. Ali loves these. And I got some diced chorizo. This is to make my red pepper and chorizo soup for Christmas Day. I just got that now. I am probably going to make it next week at some point, which is why I didn't get the peppers and the tomatoes yet, but I will get them at some point. I got some macaroni pies for me, a packet of bacon. My son requested that he wants a cooked breakfast this weekend coming because he wanted one last weekend, but I didn't have a lot of stuff in, so I made sure I got it this week. I got some chicken meatballs. I was actually going to make some, so I was looking for chicken mince. But I couldn't find any chicken mince in Sainsbury's, but I did find these. And they were the exact same price as the chicken mince. And they're already made, so yay. I got some 5% beef mince, this 750 gram pack, I think it is. A small gammon joint so I can make some lentil soup. I got a French brie because Mark and I were talking about it. He randomly just started talking about how when he was, because he was a carer, he cared for someone called Kat Katrina, I think her name was. And he was like, oh, and you cut off the rind in that and then put it on crackers. And I was like, no, you don't cut off the rind. He says, well, I always cut off the rind, the white bit on the brie, and put it in the bin. And it made me laugh so much. I was like, now I want a bit of brie. So I got that. The white Cheshire and the Wensleydale, they're from my mum. She can't get, I think it's the Cheshire she can't get, or the Wensleydale. One of them she can't get in her area, but I'd forgot what one it was. So while I was in Sainsbury's, I phoned. I says, is it Cheshire or Wensleydale? And she said whatever one it was. And then she says, actually, just get me the other one as well. So, they're for mum. I got a little packet of grated parmesan and a packet of pork cocktail sausages there for the North Pole breakfast with the kids. I got a packet of the lighter butter soft butter. This is the stuff that Ali's really liking at the minute. Well, he likes the Tesco version. We've not tried the Sainsbury one, so I hope he likes that as much as the Tesco stuff. I got some kale, a cauliflower, an aubergine carrots and orange I can't remember what that's for it's for something that Ali and I want to make um, some coriander yep spring onions I said aubergine fennel garlic red onions I've got two packets see the little petit pans is that how you say it because I'm going to make quite a bit of soup so I just thought I'd get them just to help with soup and that. That'd be a full meal. Bread and soup's nice meal in December. I also got some potato scones for Ellie's cooked breakfasts. He gave me a list of stuff that he wanted me to get. I got two packets say the pan a chocolat for the North Pole breakfast and I got some cereals. The honey nut and the wheat biscuits, that's the cheap, cheap um, wheat abix. They're just for whenever. The Elf Munch Mix is for the North Pole breakfast. This was only £1.50 and it's a big box. A tasty mix of strawberry flavoured Elf Hoops, Choco Pops and Mini Corn Flakes and Festive Stars. And I've got marshmallows because I couldn't get this, this stuff with the marshmallows in it. Anything with marshmallows in it. So I've got marshmallows for them to pop in it as well because that's what they like. And I've got these for Ali. They're caramelised biscuit flavour squares. Ugh. Basically, Biscoff flavour or Speculoos flavour. Eh, eh, get away from my pies. Just happened to see these as I was passing the cracker aisle and I was like, ooh, I fancy them. They're olive twists with green and black Italian olives. They sound delicious. They're going in the cupboard for Christmas. And I got a packet of Ritz crackers because Ellie loves them, so. I got some gingerbread and white chocolate blondie pies. Actually, let me put the flash. Yeah, that's better. You can see now. 
I'm not going to start the whole haul over again, but I'll keep it on. Gingerbread and white chocolate blondie pies with buttery gingerbread pastry. These wickedly rich little pies are perfect if you're not a fan of traditional fruit mincemeat. The buttery gingerbread pastry is filled with sticky caramel. I'm not talking to you, Rosie. <laughs> I'm not talking to you. Belgian white chocolate chips and sweet almond blondie and our gingerbread pastry people add a cute festive flourish. They sound nice. Right up my street. Cinnamon bun inspired cookies. Turkey gravy flavoured crisps. You're wanting out. Are you wanting out? <laughs> I got another bottle of Ribena. I've still got some of the other stuff left. What is that? Oh, it's the lights or something. Oh, this reflection. What is it reflecting? Something I thought, what is that white stuff on my wall? Yeah, I've still got some of the other stuff left, but I'm really, really liking this diluting Ribena, so I've got some more of that. I've got a packet of penny pasta. I'm completely out of pasta. Some golden syrup and some honey. Some candarelle sugarly. Popping corn. Some wholemeal bread. Picked this up for Ali because he loves like chocolate spread and all that kind of thing. You know the one that he gets the swirl, white chocolate and chocolate, he likes that. So I got him this, the snowy blonde chocolate spread. What does it say? White chocolate and caramel flavour spread. Sorry, it's out of focus. White chocolate and caramel flavour spread. I think he'll love that. I've got two bars of dark chocolate and two bars of milk chocolate. We're going to try and make some hot chocolate. A big packet of spaghetti. This was really cheap, this Hubbard store stuff. It was like, I can't remember how much it was. It was like 80p or something, maybe even less than that. Some biscoff biscuits for Ali. Ali also asked me to get some candy canes for the Christmas tree, to put on the Christmas tree. So picked up some while I seen them. And then these, I got two milk chocolate coins, two white chocolate coins, and two packets of these little nutcracker ones. You see them? They're for the kids' little baskets that you'll see for the North Pole breakfast. I'll show you them when I do it. And also, so are these little lint Santas. I've got two packets of them as well. Okay, I've got a big massive bag of crisps. I've got my sisters coming at the weekend, so we all like to munch crisps. I've got a packet of the frozen hash browns. If you remember, last weekend Ali wanted hash browns and I didn't have any, so got them this week. Also got some waffle fries. These look so nice. They sound so nice. They're Leon waffle fries with garlic, aioli and rosemary. Sound so delicious. I got some crispy chips, the oven cooked chips. They've got the skin on. I like the ones. I got a pile of pizzas. Um, just because I'll be working late in that. And so Ali can just chuck this in the oven if he's wanting dinner. And also got my sisters coming at the weekend, so I've got I've got a cheese one on the bottom for Elizabeth because she's vegetarian, she just eats cheese pizzas. I think I've got two chicken and pesto ones, two pepperoni and two spicy chicken. And then I've got some arancini bites, the mozzarella and tomato ones, or tomato and mozzarella. They're for Ali to have as a movie night snack next week. Some breaded cod fillets, I've got some caramel pots of joy for Ali. And then I've got these winter edition ones as well. They're just got snow on top or white chocolate. <laughs> um, I've got a tub of cream. These I wanted to try with the kids, but I couldn't find them anywhere in store. And then we looked at the reduced section and they were less than half price. They were £1.50. They're actually originally £3.50 for a packet of 10. But I've got two packets for £3. Um, I got some washing powder, some fabric softener, and I got some incense boosters. These are not in plastic tubs, it's a cardboard packaging now. Ali wanted shower gel, so I got him some more of that. And I got myself some more deodorant because I'm needing that. I got Ali pot noodles for lunches. Um, randomly, the king pot noodles were the exact same price as the smaller ones, so obviously I'm getting the king pot noodles. I got him a chicken and mushroom and a curry. I also got him this to try because it's a pigs and blanket flavoured super noodles. I got some drinks for the kids to have at the North Pole breakfast. I just got the cheap Sainsbury version of fruit shoots, which is I got them orange, two packets of orange and two packets of summer fruits. Tomato ketchup. We're completely out. I got some fine egg noodles there. 
run out of Worcester sauce, sea salt and black peppercorns, like all in the same week. I've got none of them left. Um, I've got a tub of guacamole, some salsa and some sour cream topping. I'm going to have tacos one night, obviously. What on earth are you doing up there? Hi! You... How did I leave a cupboard door open? Where did I get to? Where did I get to? Super noodles. I've got two packets of the low fat noodles, the char grilled steak ones, because they're my favourite. And I tried to get a load of super noodles for Ali and the girls and that to have, but their noodle shelf was absolutely bare. Like there was barely nothing. There was quite a few, no, there wasn't. There, this was the last Japanese katsu curry, and katsu curry is one of Ali's favourite things. So I got them a packet of them. They had a couple of things of these, but Ali's not tried them, so I only got them one, the peri peri, and then they had vegetable ones. Like, they had nothing, that was it. It was just completely empty. Anyway, I got some chicken stock pots, some bisto, because I'm run out of that. Got Ali a big, big tubby hot chocolate. He's got some hot chocolate, a 500 gram tub. Taco shells for our tacos. <laughs> Two tubs of cheesy footballs because it's not officially Christmas until I've got my cheesy footballs. And then I've got Ali a two pack of, a two pack, a four pack of orange juice. And that was everything that I got from Sainsbury's. I'll now go on to what I got at Tesco's. Ali's in the background putting our pizzas on so if you hear that noise it's him. I went to Tesco's not for a lot but I couldn't get Bucks Fizz at Sainsbury's so I need Bucks Fizz to make Christmas happen. So I got four bottles of that. It's on offer at the minute. I think it was £2.25. Also got some squirty cream or squishy cream for Ali to have hot chocolates. Oh, what's that for? Oh, beefy. Yep, it's for my pepper. Luckily, I've not got any pepper in there yet. Um, I got a tin of bean sprouts. I'm going to make chicken chow mein. I made that a couple of weeks ago and it was really good. I made it with fresh beans, bean sprouts though. Or was it last week? But I don't know when I'm going to make it this month, so I thought if I get the frozen chicken breasts and a tinny bean sprouts, I'm in no rush to make it because I do have a lot of fresh stuff that I want to use up first, like for the soups and everything. What is that cat doing? I've got some frozen chicken breasts, I've got a packet of toothbrushes because we need new ones. I went into Tesco mostly for my Tassimo coffee pods because they're on offer there at two for seven pounds. That's the kind of best offer there is at the minute because uh, Asda don't have their offer on anymore, three for ten pounds. And Amazon prices have shot up, so I got four packets of the Colombian Kenko one. That's the one I'm into at the minute. I got some maple bacon flavor pretzels. How do that sound? Maple bacon flavor pretzels. Mid. I also got these. <laughs> I had to get them just to let the kids try them. Christmas pudding flavour crisps. They're so random. I wonder how they taste. I wonder if they're sweet or savoury. I'm looking forward to trying them. And I got some turkey and stuffing bites. I think we've had these before, Ali, haven't we? Turkey and stuffing flavour bites. I think we've had them before. Uh, Maybe a couple of years ago. I also got some marshmallows, just regular marshmallows because I couldn't get many ones for Ali to have these hot chocolates. I got a tin of cosy apple cider, or apple cosy cider, that doesn't sound right, cosy apple cider it should be, um, Glade air freshener, and I got some bin liners as well because I need some, I went through so many recently, and that was everything that I got at the shops today, I've still got a lot more to get. I'll probably pop back to the shops again next week for more fresh stuff and that. But thank you so much for watching this video everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like the video if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you next time. Or tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 10. Number 7. 7. Right. Oh. Oh, this is very <laughs> It's sunny taped. What's that? Terry's <laughs> orange snowballs. Mine.
Mine. Very nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. No boys. <laughs> no boys. Lovely.